All right, I'm going to show you how to play Poe. There's going to be no sound, and I apologize if you wanted sound. But, um, it's going to sound like crap anyway because it's recording from my phone. But, I'm going to run this in double speed. You can, you can kind of see what I do. Um, basically, so you just keep, you just keep spawning stuff. I'm just going to record one speed so it's easier. You spawn that stuff in the back. Everything else is for defense. As, as you can see, I was kind of waiting, hoping it would spawn something else. See, like, like that, but. Now this is a really close game against that Palpatine, so it's probably not the best example, but actually it's one of the better examples on on how to use them. See, like, there's he's at. See, you basically use that since at level 11 my thing has a uh, 2,000 HP. So because it has um, 2,000 HP. It can def it can uh, hold its own for quite a while, which is um, beneficial because um, see that guy was smart deploying that, but um, but yeah, it, overall it's pretty uh, bene beneficial because it can it can save you. Because of how much health it has, and it does AOE. That's why I would recommend that over anything. See, see, uh, yeah, you see, you just you, when you think you have the energy and you're not going to suffer, that's what you do. And as you can see, I'm I'm kind of just using my special on the leader. See, this is where he kills me. But as you can see, things tanky. He can't attack that lane, so he went over there. I I built up energy so I can afford it. And then since I killed him, guess what? I'm attacking his tower again. It's try to go really far back on the generator too. So you don't get attacked by other towers. And then then this is pretty much where I won, you know. I stole that. I'm spawning shit on his generator. He was doing that for a freaking tie. And then at this point, I'm like, all right. He was too busy trying to get that one thing. Didn't realize I'm blowing up his freaking tower for the win. All right. That's one game. Let me just get a second one just to show you. That's a good one. I can show you this guy's deck. Um, is that all I have? I got this one. Uh, I think this guy just suicided a lot. I'll show this one on. The one with Tarkin is, I don't know, it was... So it was okay, but I'm going to try saving space so I don't have to take forever to upload it. So I'm going to view this one in double mode. You can basically see what you like. See when they do that, you spawn that, and then you airstrike that. Look at that, and there goes his entire push. His entire split push. Oh wow, I was doing some damage to that. And I'm attacking this tower again. This is where I was trying to get BB-8 in there. So I, I don't know what that guy was doing at that point. So once you get in there, though. So I was like, that thing's about to die. 
Might as well go after it. I think this is where I lost his tower. But he lost his entire push. So, that's beneficial. See, this is why you use this thing, though. See, as you can see, he's he's trying to defend. But once you get the mid-tower down, you basically... You're, you're fucked, kind of. This is where I just juke him out real quick. I'm just like, oh, shit. I'm out of here, bitch. <laughs> this is nuke is pushing. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, once you get the mid tower down, there's nothing defending it, so anything like that, that will kill it if you didn't do anything about it. Then I got a dead freaking MTV. And then this is where I win. Didn't matter what's going at there, I pretty much generated him. You see, I was three towers down, but I won anyway because I got the generator. So that's pretty much how you play Poe, at least using my deck. <laughs>